Hey guys, Wayne here from H2 Tech Videos. Today I'm gonna to show you how to mirror your LG Aristo to your TV uh, wirelessly, okay? So if you've got something on your phone that you wanna show on your TV, um, we're gonna show you how to do it today using uh, a Google Chromecast. So a Chromecast is a device that costs you about 35 bucks at most places. Uh, it'll plug into just about any HD TV, so your TV will have to have an HDMI port. Um, it plugs in there. You also need to have home Wi-Fi. You will have to connect your phone as well as the Chromecast to your home Wi-Fi network, and that's how the two are gonna communicate. So um, once your Chromecast is plugged in and set up, and the setup is really easy, you plug it in and it, it walks you through the setup. On your phone, you wanna make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi. So uh, go ahead and just swipe down from the top here and make sure this little icon here, your Wi-Fi icon is lit up. And um, go ahead and just hold down on it. And that'll basically shortcut you right to your Wi-Fi section. And so we are connected to Wi-Fi. And this is the same network that my Chromecast is connected to, okay? And we're gonna go to the Play Store, which is this little icon right here. And you're gonna do a search for Google Home, Google Home, and this app should come up. You're gonna download this app, Google Home, and we're gonna hit open. I'm gonna show you two ways that you can do this. So one way is to completely mirror your screen so whatever's on your phone will show up on your TV. The second option is using a feature called casting which is, let's say you open up YouTube, Netflix, or Hulu, or any of those video apps, uh, there's a little icon that's gonna pop up, um, and when you tap that, it'll send your video to the TV. The cool thing about this is you can still use your phone for other things while the video is playing on the TV. If you do use the mirroring option, then your phone is, it's gonna mirror whatever's on your phone, so basically you can't use your phone for other stuff while it's mirroring. So I'm gonna show you both ways to do it in the video. The setup is really quick here, so let's go ahead and just hit get started. Um, press okay, you do have to have a, um, you do have to have a Gmail account registered with it. Uh, on the last screen, it did ask, uh, you know, do you want to turn on your location services? I always say no because you, you don't need my GPS to uh, use the app. So I just say decline. And let's see, I believe, yeah. So as soon as you get to this screen that just says welcome home, um, you're gonna hit menu and go to cast screen slash audio right up here. Press okay. And then we wanna hit cast screen slash audio. And then it'll say cast two. And so my Chromecast, I've customized it so I could change the name of it. And my Chromecast is called recess. So go ahead and tap on that. You, it, right there, it should just say Chromecast for you. And now if we just zoom up here, you can actually see um, my phone is now mirrored to the TV. Let's clear it up so you can see it. So now, Anything I do on the phone is gonna show up on my TV screen. So I can go back home, and now I can, you know, everything is gonna show up on that TV. Now, the home screen does show up in, you know, kind of this uh, portrait position, but as soon as I go to an app like YouTube, let's go ahead and uh, find YouTube here. And then I turn the phone sideways, it will rotate and it will fill up the screen. Let's zoom out just a little bit here. There we go. So now, again, it is showing in full screen. It's still mirroring anything that's on the phone. It's showing on the TV. And I can just go to any video here. Let's just go ahead and go here. And I can play it right from my phone. Again, because I'm mirroring my phone, okay? Now, to me, this is not the most ideal way to use this because again, I would want to use, I would want to be using my phone while I'm watching TV, you know, or while I'm sending a video from my phone. So um, 
let's go ahead and show you how to do that. So to, to turn off the mirroring feature, you're going to swipe down and in your notification panel, you'll see it says uh, cast screen and connect it to recess. And then it says disconnect. So we're gonna tap disconnect on your phone and that will basically unlink it from mirroring. And let me show you how to play this same video. But now that we're set up with Google Home, with the Google Home app, now we can just go ahead and just mirror the screen and not, excuse me, we can just cast the video instead of having the whole screen mirrored. Let's see, there we go, something like that. Okay, so that same video, I'm gonna tap it, pause it, and in the upper right corner, you're gonna look for this icon right here, which is your cast icon. And when you tap this, this will give you the option to send that video so that it plays on the TV. So watch this. So because I hit that now, that video is showing up on the TV. But if you look at my phone, so, okay. Let me try to do a, so, well, basically just go with me here. I'm gonna unpause the video, okay? And what we're gonna do, I can actually swipe up, I can go home, and guess what? I can now use my phone for other things, but the video is still being mirrored from my phone. You see that? So to me, this is the better way to do it versus just trying to mirror your screen. Because again, I wanna use my phone for other stuff, okay? So now if you ever wanna control the video or pause it or do whatever, all you have to do swipe down and if you look in the notification panel you can control it right from here i can pause it so it'll stop playing i can close it all together and it's done and on the tv it just goes back to the the little wallpaper screen for your chromecast uh you can do a lot of things so to me that's the best way to go ahead and mirror your screen or that's the best way to basically um serve the purpose which is most people are just trying to play some type of video from their phone to the TV. And this is the best way to do it. Um, now, a scenario where you may want to mirror your screen is maybe you have pictures from a trip or from a recital and you want to show a bunch of people. Now, in that case, you'd want to use the mirroring option, which is going into the Google Home app and actually setting up the mirroring. That's when you would want your whole screen to be mirrored or a slideshow presentation or something like that. But if you're just trying to play a video or play music or Pandora, then you want to use the cast option. That option will show up in a lot of different apps. So I just wanted to clearly make sure I explained the difference between the two and hopefully you can decide which one will work better for what you want to do. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share the video if you did find it helpful. Make sure you also subscribe to HTTP videos. I'll leave a link in the description on where you can purchase a Chromecast. Again, they're like 35 bucks. If you get them on sale, they'll be even cheaper. And um, it's the easiest way to accomplish mirroring your phone wirelessly to the TV. Now, I do get that it is limited. So if you don't have Wi-Fi at home, guess what? This isn't really an option for you. There are cables you can buy to directly connect your phone to the TV, but even those are a bit hit or miss too. So uh, to me, this is just uh, the best option for most people. All right. Thank you guys for watching. Take care and have a good one.